Hey everyone, welcome back to Shady Review. In today's video, we are reviewing the Persil 24 Four, six sunglasses. And these are basically uh, Persil's version of the Ray-Ban hexagonal sunglasses. But first off, we have to thank our very generous sponsor, ShadeReviewStore.com, the absolute best place to buy designer sunglasses just like this for up to 80% off the original MSRP. These sunglasses have 52 millimeter lenses and a 20 millimeter bridge, which is very similar to the dimensions of the Ray-Ban hexagonal, which have 52 millimeter lenses and a 21 millimeter bridge. Now these sunglasses have all glass lenses and the absolute clarity of these is very, very good. Personal has some of the absolute best optical clarity in the optical business. And they also have this really nice anti-reflective material here on the backside as well. And they are going to block 100% of UVA and UVB rays as well. They also have a little etched personal logo here in the top right corner of the lens, which is very discreet. And that's there for authentication purposes. Now these kind of have personal reflective stem system. So they are gonna bend out like this and give a custom fit to the face. This reflective system isn't gonna work quite as good because these do have metal frames as it would on Perso's acetate sunglasses, but it still works really good here. And again, does give a good, a little extra bend to fit your face absolutely perfectly. Now, of course, they also have the Perso Supreme arrows here in the top corners of the sunglasses as well, which definitely adds to the styling of them. And definitely, you know, it's kind of Perso's hallmark uh, style. Now, if we move down, we can see these absolutely beautiful acetate ear rests, which look really good uh, behind the ear, just very classy and nice, and they feel very good. And like I said, they are made out of a high quality acetate material. Material. Now, these sunglasses are made in Italy and they just say here in the inner right temple of the frames, they say personal made in Italy. And the build quality of these is very, very good. They are definitely uh, built better than a pair of Ray-Ban hexagonal sunglasses, which is really nice. These also have fully adjustable nose rests. You can completely adjust these to your liking. And through the nose rest, we can see a little uh, engraved uh, personal logo through that nose rest, which looks really nice. And of course, it's also there for authentication purposes. Now, as far as hinges go, these sunglasses have very premium and substantial hinges and they feel very, very good when you open up and when closing them. They just feel very substantial and nice and very, very durable. And again, they do feel much more beefy than the hinges on the Ray-Ban hexagonal. Now, personally, I absolutely love the Carway. These sunglasses have these absolutely beautiful green category two lenses, which are gonna be great for overcast days to moderately sunny days, but they're not gonna be great for very, very bright and sunny days. They also do, of course, sell category three lenses in different colorways uh, with this particular pair of frames. But personally, I really do love these category two all glass lenses. The aptitude clarity is very, very good. And they're just a really good pair uh, to wear again on one of those kind of overcast days to moderately bright days. Now, as far as coverage from the sun goes, that's where this pair definitely struggles. Uh, as you can see here up top, there is a huge gap that lets sunlight in unprotected. And then here on the sides, again, there's absolutely a huge gap that does let sunlight in unprotected. So it's definitely not a very practical pair of sunglasses. And I would not recommend you get this if this is the only pair of, you know, fancy or designer sunglasses that you own. I would first buy something like a Ray-Ban Aviate or something with wraparound lenses or something of better coverage than this. The hexagonal style is probably one of the worst as far as coverage from the sun goes. So, you you know, these are gonna be great for outdoor parties or you know, some really non-extremely intense lighting situations and they're gonna do a really good job. But unfortunately, uh, with the coverage here, you know, sunlight just comes right in and you know, can definitely be very blinding and that's also not good for your eye health. But overall, I think it's a very good pair of sunglasses. The build quality here is really, really nice. And again, the styling here looks really good as well. I actually definitely do prefer these to the Ray-Ban hexagonal. The build quality is definitely better and they just look better in my opinion as well. Definitely more uh, unique than those hexagonal that you see a lot of people wearing all the time. And overall, like I said, just a very good pair of sunglasses. And as far as pricing goes, these are going to run around $350 directly from Purcell's website and in most stores. However, I actually picked up my pair on Amazon for around like $180. So I'm going to leave a link in description down below directly to Amazon where you guys can pick up a pair of these sunglasses for yourself if you are interested. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give me a big thumbs up down below. And of course, make sure to hit that subscribe subscribe button and then you'll be notified every single time I upload a brand new video just like this one to my YouTube channel. Again, thank you all so much for watching and I'll catch you all in the next one.